Hey Siri, what should everyone do while watching my video? Hit the subscribe button and the bell next to AJ170's name so you never miss a video. Hey guys, what is up? This is AJ170, and today guys, I have a really important video for you guys. And before I jump right into that guys, can you leave a like? It means a lot to me. And another thing, before you guys ask what game I am playing, I'm currently playing Friday the 13th on my Xbox One. This game is only available on a PC, Xbox One, and PS4. I do not believe it is available on the Mac. I don't even know if it will be, so please don't ask me. So anyways guys, a lot of you may know about this thing called Nest Tool, Nest Tool, Nessia Tool. Nest Tool. I don't, I don't know how to say it, I'm just like making fun of the name now. It's N-E-S-S Tool. It's made by uh, Tutu or somebody else. I don't really know. All I know is Tutu advertises it. And I really do think Tutu made it because of what it does. Now, the reason why I'm saying not to use it is mainly because of two reasons. Now, actually, three. The first one is, is that it's a bad app. You, you can easily do two other ways to do it that I've made a video on that is a lot more reliable and a lot better. The next reason why is because it blocks the servers from App Valley and Tutu. Now, App Valley and Tutu both sign apps by themselves. They both buy their own certificates and everything else. So they both have different apps that Tutu doesn't have. So they're really important to have on your iOS device, guys. And the third reason why is I can't confirm this, I can't pr uh, prove it or anything else, it is just a theory guys. There is a small chance that this VPN app that you download, that's what it is, what it's doing is there's a chance it could actually be stealing your personal private information guys. It could be going and search, uh, remembering what you search in Safari, whether if it's the stuff, naughty stuff you've been looking up or if it's been cheating in math and then Tutu takes that information and they sell it to corporations. Now, I don't know if that's what they're doing or not, guys. They could be. They could not be. I have no idea. Um, I mean, I wouldn't trust it personally because I don't trust Tutu at all but for personal reasons that I'm not allowed to talk about in the video because I've been asked to, uh, not to talk about it. But anyways, guys, before I jump right into this um, video, I'm going to be proving to you guys that it does block the servers from them and do not use it. So anyways guys, before I jump right in, can I, uh, can I get 170 likes? Also, if you guys are new, support the 170 and subscribe. And sorry about the lack of uploads guys, I've been really busy with college, and I've been busy with work also guys, and normally inside my time, my free time when I'm not studying or anything, I'm normally just sitting around playing video games, not really doing anything at all guys. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and jump right into this video, guys. I'm going to go ahead and meet you guys over on my iPhone now. All right, guys, so there's Tutu right here. If I go ahead and open it up, it's already going to ask me to install Nest Tool. So if I go ahead and hit Yes, Install, then I'm going to get another prompt asking it to uh, for me to install it again. Go ahead and click Yeah, Install. Now let's go ahead and wait for it to download. It's a pretty small app, so it's not going to take that long to download at all, guys. Go ahead and wait a few more seconds, and boom, it is now done downloading, guys. Now I can go ahead and open up my settings and prove it, but first I'm going to show you App Valley is currently working. As you can see, if I go to App Valley and try installing MovieBox++, as you guys can see, it does pop, uh, give me the prompt to install. If I go ahead and go over to TweakBox, I can go ahead and do the same exact thing, guys. I can open it up. It'll fully load, and I can even go to the first random app that I see and uh, uh, go all the way to the pr uh, install prompt. So if I go ahead and click apps, I'm going to go ahead and scroll down to tweaked apps, and I'm going to click the first one, and that turns out to be YouTube Plus Plus. Click install, and as you guys can see, I get the install prompt. I'm going to hit cancel on that. So now I'm going to go ahead and open up this thing. Actually, I can't. I need to approve it. So let me go ahead and verify the app first. So let me go ahead and go here and hit trust, trust again, and there we go, I now have it trust. Now I can go ahead and open up Nest Tool, and then all you have to do is click that little gray circle thing, and then it would start allowing it. Again, I don't recommend doing any of this, guys. I highly recommend using my previous video I made about how to block the, the things to where it was two different ways, but as you can see, my ad blocker is now currently disabled. So if I go ahead and hit the home button, 
and try opening up App Valley, it will not load, guys. It's really messed up. Um, I wanted to make sure that this Nest tool was working first because it doesn't show the VPN icon on the top of my status bar. So if I uh, went ahead and went to there to make sure. But if I go ahead and open up App Valley, guys, it loads up some weird flash lower HTML version and you can, it's unusable. You can't use it if you try installing one of the apps. It redirects you to Safari and nothing loads, unfortunately. And I can't believe that Tutu would create a monopoly like this. I'm really shocked that they would do that. I mean, they're already making millions of dollars a day. And then they just decided to be dirtbags and create a monopoly. It's not cool at all. And if I go ahead and open up tweak box right here, as you can see, it, it doesn't even load. I just get stuck on a white page. That's, I mean, this is ridiculous. I can't believe they did something like this. They've hit a new all-time low. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I, uh, I believe that is pretty much all I have to show you guys. That was the proof right there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and skip the video to the next part to where I actually disable it and delete it and to show you guys that they were uh, they were working afterwards. Alright guys, so I went ahead and skipped the rest of that white screen because I let that stay on pretty long inside the raw footage. So if I delete this gross app and delete the next gross app, as you can see in my VPN list, it is no longer there. So if I go ahead and open up App Valley, holy crap it works! That's because Nest Tool is blocking. If I go ahead and go to Tweakbox, wait a couple seconds for the app to load because it likes to take forever to load. And there we go. As you guys can see, Tweakbox loaded. So, I mean, you guys can continue to use Tutu app by all means. I just, I highly, highly, highly recommend you guys to delete Nest Tool if you have it. Figure out a way to get the Adblock app, use that, and then use the DNS code. That's what I do, guys. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much just about it for this video, guys. Wanted to make sure you guys were informed about this. This is AJ170 signing out. See you guys next time.